Hey everybody, Chris here. Today in this video, I'm gonna show you how to make this. Okay, it's got about 12 needles in there. And this is four pieces. This is the bottom piece. That's the top piece and the two sides. So let's get started. All right, this is about three quarter inches wide, about a half inch thick. And the length depends on the size of the needles and how much you want them to stick out. So next I'll make the base and the top out of this. Okay, now the top and bottom part is made. And the purpose of this is so the needles are forced against the back. Next, I'm gonna put this sticky back felt on here. And the purpose of the felt, which goes on the top and the bottom, is to help secure the needles. All right, now the top and bottom is felted. Okay, now I'm putting the needle in reverse so I can measure where to cut. Well, I tried to avoid the squeeze out, but looks like I got some anyways. Just gonna clean the glue up carefully. All right, now I'm going to uh, put the sides on. I use little dowels and dowel it together. And the purpose of the sides is to prevent the top and bottom from coming apart. Now the other side.
Okay, now I'm going to clamp the sides on. Alright, I just poured some super glue on the ends to uh, strengthen where the needle leaves off from the wood. Alright, so now I'm going to reshape it, make it all pretty. Alright, so here's how you use this tool. You find the string groove and then you do a rocking motion like that. And you can see how effective that is. You can try the uh, bigger one here. So I'm doing it out of the piano, so it's moving around a little bit, but here I'll... See how easy that goes in when you rock it? And so right here, you probably could use that for mating strings, too. Mating the hammers to the strings. And this one... So those are pretty long, so that's just an experiment, but let's see what it does. These are old hammers anyways. Let's see if I can rock that in there. This I'd probably use between the st strings. All right, I don't know if I'll ever use that or not, but uh, you never know. All right, hope you enjoyed that video. Thanks for watching. So if any of you were wondering why that one's painted, I just got a little overzealous. <laughs> All right, laugh at me if you will. Have a nice evening.